Okay, so they don't talk. Oh my god! Well, here's a uh, Gilda. You think anyone else don't like the look of each other? I haven't seen someone with a body like that in far. My goodness, Gilda. Oh. Ah, you're not so bad yourself. You should have seen me before all this. Red hair that was the envy of every girl and legs for days, darling. I'm sure you'd rather hear some of my stories from the silver screen rather than talk about that nasty murder business. I must say, you're quite the actress. What can I say? It just comes naturally. Care to hear some of my stories, Detective? Oh, yes, please. Have you ever done radio? Your voice is quite enchanting. Well, darling, play your cards right, and maybe I'll whisper some sweet nothing to you. Ooh. Surely you must be here for my salacious stories of the silver screen. I must say, I've known flesh and blood girls who aren't half the woman you are. Keep it up, Tyler. Thank goodness. I'll find out if you can handle how much a woman I am. Oh. my stories, detective. Why don't we... Grab a bottle of wine and go watch the sunset. Mm, sounds good, detective. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. So she's gonna tell me everything, right? That was great, detective. But we probably shouldn't make a habit of this. Catch you later, tiger. Did I just have sex with a robot? That is not what I expected to happen. Where'd she go? I had to ask her a question. 